It is not a coincidence that in four or five of the recent shootings that have been publicized by the media, by the way, not publicized the way you would think, they have involved somebody who identifies as trans. There are people right now in the media that are making it about the shooter and saying that they are the ultimate victim and tragedy. If you don't believe me, you can go back and look at some of the things that the New York Times is saying. You can look at National Public Radio, their assertions regarding this situation. And of course, you can spend lots of time looking at the Communist Nationalistic Network, otherwise known as CNN. They are all saying the same thing. They are continuing to make it all about the fact that this poor little girl or boy was the victim of a series of issues that drove them into this place. And had there been no guns in existence, then this would not be the case. I will make myself very clear here. The actions of the law enforcement officers in this context was absolutely heroic. It was remarkable. It was something that goes beyond the capacity for a lot of people to be able to understand. And our law enforcement officers have a very, very tough job. And this is why we should support them. But with that said, if we had a vet who was armed, posted at that door, and there was a single point of entry, that person would have died before they attempt to go in with their weapon. Bottom line is, that lady would not have been able to get out of her van without being stopped. One thing has become clear as a result of all of this. When we talk about the activity represented by people who oppose God's law in what God has established to be natural, when people blatantly say, I refuse to adhere to what God has established in his own creation. Understand this, ladies and gentlemen, this is very important. You are opening up the door to the demonic realm. You are opening up the door to something that is completely dark and completely wicked. The reality of it is, what we are seeing in these shootings and what happened with this particular shooter is a direct result of a human being in their hatred and rebellion towards God, opening themselves up to a demonic realm that brings them to a place of self-mutilation, destruction, and the destruction of others. Everything that we're witnessing right now, if you want the summary of what's going on when it comes to what has happened at this school, it's spiritual. It's spiritual. 